Hello everyone, today we will review new small kit from Mark 1 models. As you can see it's TA 152H1 high altitude fighter which was used by Germans in World War II. Actually they were built on the like few airplanes but here we have double kit so uh, we have two kits in one box. On the front side we have this nice box art and on the box, back side we have Mm, four marking options which are available in this kit so basically you'll be able to make two out of four that's typical side opening box and inside we find double set of the spruce as I said before assembly manual I will show it first Assembly menu is quite simple, there is no history of the airplane, but we have parts map and assembly instructions, which are given, as you can see, covers are given in standard designations. And here also recommended this Focke Wolf Ta 152 publication from the same publisher. Marking options also shown in the assembly guide, and as you can see, they are printed in covers, so it's quite a useful feature for such small kit. I think the actual size of the model will be like this. Nevertheless, let's move to the spruce. They are absolutely identical as you can see, so... Just a moment. Yes, now you see it. Absolutely similar, so we will check only one set. Uh, let's check first the sprue with fuselage halves. As you can see, fuselage itself is not that big, roughly the size of my point finger. And it's molded with some <coughs> features together with some features. As you can see, exhausts are molded together with fuselage. Also, we see here propeller with molded together with blades. And front cooling with cooling flaps is molded separately. Note that they're open. And what's interesting here, I think also it's important to note that here is a separate dashboard for the cockpit and I think that the cockpit weighs. And air intake is also molded separately in such tiny model. Then we have another sprue uh, which features wing part. As you can see it's molded as one piece so we won't have to glue two halves together. Nevertheless, wheel wells are quite simple, so uh, some modelers can detail them up. And also we have here some landing gear parts, uh, external tank and propeller hub. You can see it here. Note that wing is molded together with gun barrels, so you have to be careful uh, during installation of this part. And also we have this small a uh, separate bag which contains transparent parts and decals. Transparent part of course is given as a single piece as you can see and you have to deal with some really tiny masking. And decal sheet uh, contains all necessary symbols, just give me a second to open it. Here it is. Of course there are no stencils but the symbols which are present are printed in very nice quality and there are separate decals for the cockpit. So it will be pretty much detailed. And that's all for this kit. Uh, don't forget to check full article on our website. And I would also recommend you to like our Facebook page so you can get fresh updates in time. Thank you for watching and see you soon.